Hello everyone, my piety rating must have been high enough, as my prayers have been answered, and a new patch has been uploaded for Crusader Kings 2, allowing me to play for more than one year. So, let's see who we're going to pick. I have an idea in mind. Let's go to Dukes. I'm going to play as the Duke of Transylvania. Why? Because it sounds cool who's currently under the con of the Golden Horde. So my first objective will be to become independent, and we'll see how that goes as we wait for the game to initialize, and we'll see what happens. Listen to the catchy music as the files are loaded. There we go. Hello. Ooh. Ooh. People got to get married. All right, who wants to marry my sexy bald head? I do have a child. I don't know how. Magic in the Middle Ages, no doubt. All right, let's see here. First, let's get married. Uh, I am not liked by my liege, which may be a good thing, considering I want to try to break away from him. All right, let's arrange a marriage because that's a good thing to do because then I'll be able to align myself with somebody and that looks like an excellent choice for aligning myself with the princess of the Byzantine Empire even though I'm zealous. As long as you accept, I don't really care because I'm going to be aligned with you. So that was easy. And my heir is also unmarried, so we will find him a wife as well. Ah, let's see who is good here. <laughs> married to the same chick. That's probably not such a good idea. We have Bohemia. I think I might do that too. Isn't Bohemia right next to me, kind of? I think it's over here. That'll work. We'll do that. Unmarried heir. Bohemia. I will spare you me singing Bohemian Rhapsody. Unless you want me to. I don't hear anybody speaking up, so that's okay. Alright, take care of those things. Check our council. First, let me see what I actually own here. Let me open up my outliner. I own two lonely territories. It's very sad and... I need to expand that, I would think. So here's the council, pretty good ratings. I'm going to do what? Let me see if people in my court like me. All except for that guy, because I'm an infidel. What does he know? Uh, he is the high chiefdom of Transylvania. So, somewhere in here. So, I'm going to use him to improve diplomatic relations. This guy can research military. This guy can research economy. We'll have him uncover plots, because that's always fun. Ooh. Yes, I know he has. That's my son, apparently. And improve religious relations. Uh... Titles are divided among children with the oldest getting the primary title. That's interesting. I can change it if I want. I don't think I really need to at this point, though. Everything is normal except for feudal taxation. How much money am I bringing in three a month? That's pretty good. Uh, as for technology, let me see what type of troops I would get. Uh, let me merge these guys. We'll unpause this for a little bit. I want to see what type of troops I have. <laughs> I don't have very many. I'll tell you that right now. What is that, like 200? I like the five guys marching through the hills. Alright, let's see what we got here. I decided to limited crown authority in Hungary. Sure. I want money. Excellent. I want more money. Money, money, money. 
All right, let's. Good for them. Let's see what type of troops I have as soon as everybody marches over. March, 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 march. Go, 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 go. Hurry up. There we go. All right, what merge are these guys? What do we have? 49 light infantry and 240 heavy infantry. Uh, I can't replace any of the leaders because my crown authority is too low, but they're actually decent anyway. So light and heavy infantry. Let's go back to our techs. Uh, let's do light armor. As for economy, I get mine from two castles. So I think farming is okay. Castle opinion, town opinion, church opinion. Prestige. Let's get some prestige from Majesty. Intrigue. Hmm. Convert to Liege's culture. I don't think I want to become a Mongol. Let's see if this has what I want in here. Which is to tell my Liege to make me independent. It does not. That's okay, though. All right. Well, I think that's about it for right now. Uh, so we're going to run the game for a little bit and see what happens. Ooh. Ah, he's at war. My little dude guy. All right, well, I can strike down these. I don't need you anymore. Go away. Uh, while this is running, we can check out some of the new map modes that got added. Here's the opinion of everybody. I like myself. These people, not so much. You can see the different dynasties. That's kind of cool. As it auto says. Just in case. The revolt risk. Ooh. Golden Horde not holding down the fort too well. That's uh, economy. So you can look for good territories. There's the de jure empire is Byzantine. Direct vassals, de jure kingdoms, what people should have, what. Your duchies, culturalist, uh, religion, <laughs> half Catholic, half whatever the yellow thing was. Diplo relations, independent rulers, and terrain. All right. So we'll run this at full speed. New Pope, good for him. And the Golden Horde is just going to war with everybody. I kind of wish I could revolt against him. I wonder if there's a way I can do that diplomatically here. Let's see. Liege. Hello. I hate your guts. Can I declare war against you? Oh, yes, I can. <sighs> well... I'm hoping that he's too preoccupied with everybody else to fight me. Because he's fighting all these other people. There's only one way to find out. Do it. Press the button. Hmm. You do like me more than my enemies, don't you, Byzantine Empire? You join or the, my marriage was in vain and I'll sleep on the couch. All right. Troops. Here we go. Oh, I got more troops. That's cool. All right. Let's see. I always put this on diplomatic so I can remember which areas I'm going after. Now, one thing I'm worried about, uh, it's pretty difficult to storm castles because, uh, well, you'll see. Huh. Because the assaulting army has to be bigger than the defenders, and the defenders have been upgraded significantly uh, in this game from when I really played it last, when I did the preview for it. So, I am legendary. Yes! I love you, father-in-law. You're my favorite. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Yeah. All right. Well, let's see. Yeah, see? 189 to 585. That's going to result in untimely death for me. So he has to get out. You're going to get out, too. And I need to get more than 500 troops in there. 
So I really need my whole army in one spot, unfortunately, uh, to kind of get that going. Let's see, what's my income now? It's only two. That's not too bad for having all my troops raised. So conceivably, I could do some upgrades, too, just in case this guy wants to get a little saucy and uh, start to invade me. So I'm going to get a low stone wall here. And my council can be reassigned, so I'm going to have him oversee construction. And I think the rest of these guys are all right. Okay, 706. That should be enough to take that territory. Let me see who I want to actually get. They're all about the same economy. So I'm just going to go after the closest one. And then we'll see what happens. Yeah, two on one. How do you like them apples? Ah, oh, 1%. Darn. So there's my siege. 690 to 591. Not much of an advantage here. That's okay, though. I have nobody else. Yeah, take that, defenders. We'll take your castle. Yes, yes, more. More tasty flesh. I don't even see any of his guys over here yet. He must be preoccupied with the 15,000 other wars he's in. There's my ally. Oh, hey, how's it going? Ooh, pause. Uh, we propose that Prince of Serbia and some chick gets married. Who is that? That's uh, just somebody in my court. And she wants to get married. So I think I'll fulfill her life ambition. Even though I hate her guts. Because uh, she's a glutton. Apparently I'm a... Uh, I hate fat chicks. I'm sorry. I'm just a shallow guy. What can I say? You know, some guy with a gigantic bald head hates fat chicks. I don't think anybody like that should be so picky, but that's the way it is. So have fun in Serbia, lady. I wonder if they're my ally now. I don't know if it counts if they're in your court. I think it has to be. Yeah, it just has to be thing. So. Uh, yeah, you already joined. What about Bohemia? You cannot call vassals to war. Oh, because he's a vassal of the stinking... Holy Roman Empire, that's why. Well, oh well. At least I got some inroads with Bohemia just in case they decide to break free anytime soon. So, my siege is going pretty good. Let me see what this war score says for things I can do to get higher percentages and maybe you can win percentage here. I think it usually only says it when you actually do something. I haven't done anything yet. <sighs> you stupid son. What's his opinion of me? 53? What should I do? I don't think you're ready. You're only 18. You just got your driver's license. A couple years ago. So take that, Laszlo. There's too many accent marks in your name. How dare you ask for land? I don't really have anything to give him anyway. I only have two. A blow was struck. Okay, come on, Siege. Uh, that was actually kind of significant. 5%. Well, my troops just got out. Go. Go, Siege. Go, Siege. Go, Siege. And you have to Siege every single one of these little guys. Um, one at a time before you take the whole province, which means sieges take a long time, which is actually okay because you can't just bulldoze over everybody. Uh, whatever. My bishop. He's still 73. Levy's raised too long. Well, I'm fighting the war, baby. What you gonna do? Sorry. Oh, good. I wonder if I can have him do something else. I don't even need it. Do I have any claims on anything? No, I don't. I just have the two counties and the duchy. It's kind of just... Oh, there we go. There's the army. Hey. Byzantine Empire. Where are my homies at? Nowhere. 
63. How old is my wife? 28. Yeah, pretty awesome. I don't think I'm going to survive long enough to have any kids. That's okay. Oh, hello. Ooh. Yes, we know. The mayor likes me now. Awesome. Good job. We would like you to back our plot to acquire the kingdom of Croatia from Hungary. <laughs> I might just accept because I'm not going to be alive long enough to do anything about it. Sure, why not? I'll back your plot. Crusade. Yeah, I'll get right on that. Don't worry. Do I have any troops left I can raise, maybe? Yeah, yeah, I know. Sorry, I gotta fight for my right to party. Oh. Tell you what, the AI with this new patch is being a lot more active. I didn't hardly get this many things uh, before. I haven't noticed any AI issues while I've been playing the game, which is cool. Uh, and they got a couple more months to hammer on it before it's finished. I think one way to make Hungry mad is enough. Because <laughs> they're going to totally take over my entire country when it becomes time. So, Boy, you're just one crazy guy proving all my relations. I wonder... Let me do that. Let me do that. That's a good idea. See, new map modes is going to be useful. What I'm going to do is use the revolt risk, and I'm going to send this guy to a territory that might revolt. Except that I need to figure out one with a big army in it. See, that's a big one. Let's do that right there. 1.46. I think that's the big ooh, that's even bigger. Yeah, Turnu. You guys hate the Golden Horde leader, don't you? Yeah, sure you do. So he has a 32% chance of lowering the opinion. So maybe I can get him to revolt too. He's not already revolting. Holy good goodness. Look at that. I'm not quite that. <laughs> I just got my one lonely war. This guy's at war with like 15 people. All right. Well, I built my medium stone wall, so good for that. Let me merge these guys together here. Oh, look. I can appoint some leaders. All right. Uh, leader, best leader would be the guy with the highest military rating. He's already there, and he's already there, so the next guy is this guy who doesn't like me. But he has a... You know, the other guys are like threes, so. All right. Well, I don't think this war is going to turn out too well, to be quite honest. Of course you have. Of course you have. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, well. As you can tell, I'm taking this game very seriously using ingenious tactics like attacking countries that are five times larger than I am. Well, while I wait to get my uh, butt kicked, let's look at some of these things. Ooh, yes, uh-huh, yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Somebody died. We have been attacked. We're about to get attacked again, I'm sure. He doesn't seem to be too eager to come over. Yeah. <laughs> That's a bad thing, usually, when there's that many red territories. Perfect. It is perfect. Ooh, there's a little... Two people that don't like me fighting each other. Yeah, minus one. You going to offer a piece? I'm sure not. No, oh, white piece. I lose 100 prestige, but... I don't think there's any way I'm going to get him. I'm winning the war. You are winning the war by like 1%. Pregnant. Hey, want to join my war? Everybody's doing it. It's Middle Ages. There's not really anything else to do. There's no TV yet. 
course you will. Thank you. You're an awesome ally. I'm going to send you a nice Christmas card. I don't even know if it's worth if it's worth doing that. Who owns that? Oh, Hungry owns that. Or if I should help the other guy kick some hungry butt. I'm not sure. He's doing okay right there though. Let's just see let's see what happens. Ooh, that's uh not so good up ah, there we go. I knew you were gonna show up. Alright. Before I lose this battle. I'm just not going to win that, so I'm going to take the 100 prestige hit and just not have to worry about you anymore. Oh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. So by going to peace with him... I just went back, yeah, he's my leash, and now I'm at war with all the other people I was kind of allied with. Well, that's weird. Oh, well, that's just, yeah, that's all, just all his battles. I'm not necessarily fighting them, per se, but that's all right. Oh, that was an experiment in failure. That's all right, though. Let's just stand all these guys down. And then we'll worry about hungry here in a little bit. I wouldn't... Th I don't know if these guys are going to kind of go after me or not. So what is that? Is that still part of the Golden Horn? Yeah. They're just all the little people that are going to war with them. He's a very active guy. That would just drive me insane trying to fight all those different wars. As long as you guys don't come into my duchy, you know, you guys can do whatever you want. I guess these mountains are impassable here. That's actually a good thing. I have a son. Sure, Imre. The chieftain of Fairher will be lost. Why? I don't know. Oh, yeah, because that's why. Because it's gavel kind, so. Everybody gets some land, which is, uh, you know, unfortunate. I'm kind of surprised at 65 I was able to father a child, but hey, that's the way the world works sometimes. Oh, uh, is there anything else I can do right now while well, the game is regenerating my troops that I can use to go after Hungary a little bit? can't even find my own war in here. That's it, this one. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's a lot of people versus him. Am I in here somewhere? Yeah, there I am. There's me. Hey, what's up? Transylvania, what's up? Again, people that... Ha oh, look at all those rebels. Hey, I wonder if that was my dude. That's sitting right there. Look at him. Oh, no, he's down the other province. That was the one I was going to send him to. Trying to incite some hate against my king guy. Ah, uh, yeah, Golden Horde won. Yay. Good job, sir. Whatever. Just don't invade me, you know. Just don't have enough levies. I think that given time... I could build enough. I actually have enough gold now. I can probably build something else. Now, which title am I going to lose? Let me make sure I don't build anything there. That guy. All right, so I'm going to build everything in this one. I think over time, I'd be able to increase my levy size a little bit. Let's make some cavalry. Can do it 150. Here we go. And we'll send... He's still overseeing construction in the same place. I'm not going to have him train troops. To help raise some troops. Let's, after it saves here, we can see how much infantry I can have to play with. And go invade some territory for fun and profit. Oh, see, that's a lot more. Why did I have that many people before? Seriously. And some merchant troops. 
see where I can go. Are you marching? No, you're not marching towards me. Nothing going on over here, guys. Alright, merge. And that's only one. Alright. I guess I'm at war with them. Yeah. Alright. Let's go. And I don't know if 589 is going to be enough. Depends on what the castle has in it. Let's see what we got here. Pause. Oh, I pressed something. There we go. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. That, not okay. So I'm going to move you over to Pest. Okay, I'll let you join that. Yes, 1%, not that big of a deal. 5% could get me in trouble. Yeah, we're 5% up. I can't make peace, though, because I'm not the main dude, so... I'm just in this for the... for the experience, I guess. It's actually doing pretty good. I wish I did good when I invaded my guy. But, you know... That's what happens. That's a lot of people, too. I don't think there's any way I could take on the Golden Horde anyway. But that's alright. Alright, well, we'll just keep an eye on these sieges here. I wonder if I can, since I don't like Hungary now, I'd see if I can fabricate some claims. I want to see which one I would rather get. Which one has the highest tax income? This one does. 38. That one's kind of being sieged, though, so I don't really know if I want that one. Fabricate claims. This is totally mine, guys. Look, it's written right here. They are foolish. And yeah, my stable's done. So that should give me some more troops. It actually has pretty good income for only having two territories. Spending one and a half a month on troops. Good. Hey, good job, son. Frank. Nice name. Pulled out of the Scrabble letters. 500 points, triple word score. See, that's the bad one. Disease. Okay, who forgot the first aid kit? Raul, was it you again? Can't trust that guy. Oh, he's being attacked. But he stands tall. Yeah, victory. Boom. All right, good for them. Not good for me. Then I just, yeah. There we go. Look, no, that's yeah. I'm still going. Still trucking. Ah! Oh, now I'm ill. Probably because I'm old and bald. But mostly old. Let's see what ill does to you. Minus 10% fertility. I would say so. Oh, good. That was the shortest illness in the history of you know, like a cold. Still trucking at 67. 50% fertility. 65% fertility. I got a hot wife. I'm going to play as that guy. I reckon. Kind of surprised I haven't seen it. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna choose a plot. Let's choose a plot. Or an ambition. They're all ambitions. These are the ones where you got to have a whole bunch of something. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to have a donor. Let me see my ratings. Probably more likely to be the Chancellor. So we'll just pick that one. Alright, we jump ahead a little bit because Fraps crashed on me. That's okay. Uh, what happened in the meantime was I got kicked out of Hungary because the Hungarian armies decided they didn't like me taking their land. So I'm just kind of sitting back here. 
Uh, I still, I don't own anything in Pest anymore. I still own something up here, I think. Two ter, you know, a castle and a town. That's pretty good. Up in that region, but that's about it. So I'm just kind of sitting, biding my time, waiting for my allies to come in there. I do have a 29% on there, so. Or a 5%. That's the one I'm in right there. There we go. So, uh, that's about it. So, obviously, Fraps doesn't want me to play anymore. So, we'll take that as a sign, possibly from the Pope. Let's see. Are you responsible for this, sir? He does have a 50.2% moral authority. And I think 50 or more uh, can affect programs on your computer. So, we'll just let him decide how much I can play. And uh, see you all next time. Bye.